I'm Hester. I am in wet leg and I work out. I'm also in the band wet leg. Um, my shoe size is six and a half. come from the Isle of Wight. I started playing when I was 17. I did like a music course. I dropped out of my A-levels and then I'd heard about this vocational music course that you could do and I'd always liked singing and so that was like my first experience of being in a band and playing music with other people and I started kind of writing songs, they were quite folky, yeah. Uh, I first acquired a guitar when I was about 15 or 16 and I learnt like all the songs off Laura Marling's first album um, and that kind of started me off writing songs as well, yeah. I got the big D, I went to school and I got the big D. Began at End of the Road Festival in Dorset in the UK in 2018. We made a pact to try something new. Mm. And we did. Yeah. We saw how much fun uh, like idols were having on stage. And that was quite, I don't know, a moment when we're like, let's play guitars. Playing guitar looks fun. I think we knew that we wanted to be a bit louder and we wanted to write songs that were less sad and maybe a bit more like, yeah, a bit more poppy. I think we've noticed since recording it, um, there is like a link between a lot of the songs. Um, it's kind of laced with, I don't know, I think for the most part we wanted to write like a party like kind of like pumped up fun album but it is kind of like laced with disenchantment and i think that is like the running theme probably i think there are like loads of influences that we both have yeah but when it comes to writing i think we try and be a bit free, maybe, although we definitely do have role models. Good times all the time. time. <laughs> I think it's nice that you've given it a double meaning. Yeah. Because obviously, one can't have good times all the time. That would be outrageous. <laughs> we started the band because like it, it had to be it had to be fun and it was yeah. Yeah, I think we've come a long way. Like I remember the very first gigs we did, like I for one was quite timid and scared. Yeah. <laughs> a lot. Yeah. And now we've got to do like small tours and, and things it's like yeah exposure therapy it gets easier to enjoy it over time we're going to go to america we're going to go to america <laughs> yeah we're going to america yeah we're really excited 
we're really excited to get the band back together. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go to gas stations and the motels and the Taco Bells. Hopefully Dollywood. Yeah, that would be really cool. If it all stops. Might go into floristry. Mm. Always wanted to try that. Um might become an accountant. That's why you dress like this. <laughs> I'm ready. I'm in my accountant's <laughs> uniform. I've really got a passion for accountancy. Well, I know where to come with my floristry business. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll sort you out. <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes.